Good morning, my friends. Friends. What is a friendship? How is it described? How is it classed? It's just that, a friendship. I'm sure you've all heard the expression, keeping my head above water, trying to stay afloat. This is because life is like treading water, being at sea. On a calm day, it's easy to stay afloat. You can lie back, enjoy the sun, listen to the seagulls, enjoy your surroundings, it's easy. When life becomes a bit more turbulent, on a stormy, rough day, it is more difficult to stay afloat. And things we may do in life, which drag us down, working a job we hate, doing things we don't really want to do, doing things we feel make us less than our potential. Anything that is any form of negativity that we hold on to, guilt is a prime example. Having guilt is like putting po stones in your pocket and they weigh you down even further. And then on a stormy rough day, it's too difficult to stay afloat. I was determined that I could do anything and achieve it all on my own, me, I've got this. I've come a long way, but instead of asking for help when things started to get difficult, I waited until I was drowning. I was already under. And the first person to come along and offer me assistance, I scrambled onto. And they sent me further under than I was or ever had been before. Um, yeah, anyway, friendship is when two people build a ship together to float on life's waters. In a friendship, even the roughest storms can be weathered and floated upon with ease, right? But in your friendship, you must have equal ideas, equal respect and love for each other. And as well, a similar understanding on the direction that your ship is traveling. If one of you believes wood is the best material, one of you believes steel is the best, new way, old way, you build your ship together, there's no common ground there. That ship will float, bolt it together, it will float. But as soon as a large enough storm comes along, it will split it in two and the friendship is over. The friendships that withstand even the most severe weathering and storms in life are those built with mutual respect, love, admiration, understanding. I want to help each other. Don't try going it alone. A friendship 
can't be built on your own. There's no self-ship. There's no me-ship. No I-ship. There's no definition for those because it needs a friendship. For those times in life that are the hardest, we need to know we can rely on somebody else to help us stay afloat in the ocean of existence, the oceans of life. I don't know how well I'm getting these things across. Again, I see it all in picture form and it's difficult to put into words, but that's what I got. Friends building a ship together, splitting if not built out of mutual love and respect, but withstanding anything and allowing the other person to have a rest. It only takes one person to steer the ship. So you can get on board that ship and have a rest in the times of need, knowing that your friend will sail you in the right direction. Hope this helps. Namaste.